Good evening. My name is Maureen Miller, and I teach Honors Chemistry and AP Chemistry, and I'd like to welcome you tonight and help you learn a little bit more about AP Chemistry course setup or Honors Chemistry course setup. If you look at the Canvas page for either AP Chemistry or Honors Chemistry, uh, you will see the setup is similar for both courses as far as where you can find information. Uh, teacher contact information, there is an email button. One of the best ways to contact me is through email, so you can click right here for some email information. If you'd like to leave me a message or text me, there is a Google Voice number right here. And if you'd like to know a little bit more about me, you can read a little bit in the Meet Mrs. Miller section. As far as course expectations, the syllabus is the best source of information for uh, course content as well as classroom and grading policies. If you click on the syllabus button, you will find a downloadable document in which you will find course expectations as well as the grading format, units to be studied, and student responsibilities. If we look at the um, AP Chemistry page, you will see a similar setup on the home area where you find an email link as well as the Google Voice number listed as well as a little bit more information about me. The syllabus, again, will give you uh, course information, student expectations, as well as grading policies. Uh, the, to access our schedule and our current unit of study, it can be done in two ways. If you are on the home screen and you click on modules, the current unit of study will always be the top module. Another way is to navigate to our current unit of study through the home page. You will find buttons for each of the units that we study. Our current unit, unit of study will be identified. If you click on the unit, you will see our schedule for the entire unit. It contains the day of the week, as well as the objectives that students are responsible for, any coursework that we will be doing during that day or during, let's say, those two days. And over on the right will be any homework assignments that the students are responsible for. Um, many assignments are uploaded to Canvas, and um, as elect, uh, they, uh, they're uploaded electronically. And the purpose of that is twofold. The first is that it provides a record keeping system that we can maintain for the entire uh, course. So that in December, if we want to go back and look at a particular assignment, we have an electronic record of that. The second reason is that um, exclusively many colleges are requiring electronic submissions and to acquaint students with this practice now sets them up for success later on. When you, if you have any questions at all about the, uh, what we're doing in class or what a particular policy is or um, you know you will be gone perhaps for an event and uh, students want to know what they, you know, you want to know what your students will be responsible for. The uh, unit plan is the best place to look for that information. As far as class expectations, again, the syllabus, if you do uh, download that document and keep, uh, look at that, you will see class expectations as well as grading policies. The uh, easiest way to contact me is email, but again, Google Voice, um, you can either text me or call me.